Hey there, it's Boots on here. This is an Indeset IWB5113 washing machine. I'm going to show you how to clean the lint filter on it. Down here on the bottom there's this plastic panel along the front. Pop these bits off the top. The same to get popped open at the bottom. And over here on the right is the filter. And it will be full of water. So, in this case, I've got a towel. I'm going to Get as much of that towel in and around and underneath it as I can and open it very slowly. Now there's something stuck in there. So there's water coming out, so let's let that trickle out now. Okay, so there's still a little bit of water coming out, but it's not flowing anymore. There's something stuck in here, so I can only twist it and it gets caught. I can twist it a bit. And it gets stuck again, so I just need to keep working on it. Oh! It's probably a hair elastic. There's some gritty, dirty water down there in the bottom, so that's probably the tail end of it. So that's it. Out. Oh dear. There's loads of stuff in here. You see that? It's all hair clips. Yikes. And back over here, even more hair clips. So in the kitchen sink, here's the filter just to give it a clean off. What you can't appreciate when you see this on a video is the smell. It's not like the smell of poo or anything, it's just the smell of dirty old water that's been stuck with rusty hair clips. So that's clean enough for me. And then in here I've got a dishcloth and look at that black coming out there. So that's just rusty water. It's held in place by those hair clips. Let's just give that a clean. We know that this one was working, we're just cleaning it for routine maintenance, so there's no reason to check anything. I just put that back in, tighten it up, and tighten it up as far as it will go, and that's it done. And then line those three tabs up at the bottom, snap it in at the bottom, and then snap it in at the top, and that's it where we should be. So that was the Indeset IWB5113 washing machine. Thanks for watching. See you later.